Hello, my name is Stephanie, the creative girl behind the designs. Thanks for joining me today and welcome to my channel. Today we're going to be setting up my November monthly pages with the Fall Har Harvest Happy Planner sticker book. So stay tuned. Okay, so we are going to be setting up um, the November pages, the November monthly pages for my classic happy planner. I will be using the fall harvest book again because um, I'm gonna try it. We'll see how far I can get with it, but I'm gonna try doing a one book July, or sorry, not one book July, one book November. And that would mean I would stick to just this book. Now, if you tuned in to the last video, I did the um, currently page in which I did the goals paper on it and use this sticker book. So I'm going to kind of see if I, how far I can go with it. So I don't know that I'll be able to do all the weeks with just one book, but we'll see. For now, though, we're going to step in and um, just start right up and do our, my November pages. So this is my uh, currently page, which I did add a little more color um, just to kind of jazz it up a little bit. So uh, I'm going to pull these out and we're going to get started. We're going to see how much I can make this a short video this time. <laughs> I always say I'm going to do a short video and then it just becomes this big to do. But that's how planning goes. Sometimes you want it a certain way and you just got to do what you got to do. Okay, so we are going to start in with the Fall Harvest book. I had been debating about a few different looks that I wanted to do, and it was really hard to choose. Now, I had done my November monthly page 2022 using this book. So what I'll do is I'll, I'll, put a, I'll throw in a picture of it um, in the filming or recording of this. I'll just pop in a picture for you to see real quick. I used all the florals. Um, so this time, I think I want to try and use, I still kind of want to go with that, you know, brown, uh, amber kind of colored feel for now. We'll see how it progresses. You know, sometimes I change my mind as I go along. But right now, that's what I'm thinking. Um, so let's see. I have, <clears throat> excuse me, I have a terrible allergies I think going on <clears throat> or maybe I'm getting a cold I don't know so where am I starting here I'm gonna start I know for sure I'm gonna be using this washi again and um, I'm thinking now that I'm looking at this and I also to the side of ha I have that same green color because if I need a swash of color somewhere then that's a the color I'll use that'll keep it kind of tied together with that currently page. So I am going to use the washi. I had decided upon, um, <clears throat> excuse me, my gosh, I have such a frog in my throat. Okay, so it's not this brown. So let me show you the brown I'm talking about. So it's mostly these browns I'm thinking I kind of want to use. So what I'm going to do I'm going to start it off with, of course, whiting out my notes <laughs> because I know I'm going to use that area. And then I have some, let me grab these stickers. So I'm going to be using these boxes and uh, this as well as this sticker. And there was another one, this one, and then I'll be adding in extras. So that's going to get us started. So let me go to this one first because I think I can fit this in. It's pretty big, but let me try. It's so pretty. A little bordered box that I already have nail polish on. <laughs> Remember, I think I've mentioned it more than a few times. If you have, you know, like white paper and you do this, some reason nail polish always comes off. For me, it does. I don't know why that is, but that's what happens. So my intent is to try and put this over here while taking up the, mo the minimal amount of, I may have to pop in, 
Yeah, so I'm so right now the only thing in the way at the moment technically is this and then November, but I can fix those easily. I really kind of want to try and get this over there. Let me get my tweezers. I am, you know, getting trying to get geared up here for the holiday. And uh that means getting everything together. I'm just lining up some images here. Okay. Um, so that just requires that I get caught up with a lot of things and get ahead, actually. And that's the better thing. So it is going to cause me to have to cut down some of the image, which is okay. Um, the one that'll be more difficult is the one going around the curve up here. I'll just cut it square and then I will go back through and trim it out, um, with my rotary tool. It just makes the curve in there a little bit easier to, to get into that little nook. Just making sure I got this edge better. All right, so let's see if I can square this off as best as possible. I'll show you the tool that I use and, um, and I'll just do that later. So I kind of just pulled it apart for now. Okay, so it is this friskers tool and basically what you do is i don't want hopefully i'm not going to cut myself here but if you can see the blade rotates around so it makes it easy to really get into that spot really well so that's what i'll use later um i don't have my cutting board under this anymore so i don't want to um run the risk of cutting through my paper and getting my desktop that aside so I will be putting back in the number five, and then I will redo possibly uh, November. I'm not really sure if I'm going to do that, but there's that. All right, let me go back to the beginning of the book. And I know for sure that I am going to be using these gold boxes. I'm going to put down what I know is for certain right now. So this is a beautiful floral box and it covered, I love these boxes when they cut out the number for them, it's just perfect. I'm gonna put this in on this day because this is a day where I make a point, I do not work, I, I spend time with family and um, I go, uh, just a personal note, I go to the cemetery, I visit uh, my brother's grave. He had passed many, many years ago, and so I do not do anything on this day. So I'm going to block that off. I'm going to use that as my block off date. And then I'm going to come back over here. <clears throat> I want to use those washi, but I'm looking at this area down here. There isn't a whole lot of area. So let me just see if I'm gonna even gonna be able to get that in there. Uh, where'd they go? Right here. So I have, let's see, there's two longer ones, which probably go over here, a longer one and a shorter one. They look small enough, let's give it a try. Oh, you know what? <laughs> it's not even a smaller one. Is that the same? It is, okay. Well, hold that thought for a minute. Let me put these on my scissors so I don't lose it. And let me grab this longer one. I thought they were longer stickers. Okay, this will work. Let me put this down here. We are going to get this one on this side because I think this one can handle the longer one. It should be able to, let's see, right? Yeah. All right. And these long washies, they're quite wiry. They'll get away from you if, the, if you let them. <laughs> All right, so because of the kind of sticker it is, I'm going to have to put it. I have these really long sleeves on, and they're kind of getting in my way now. <laughs> I need to put it right to the end of the page. Like, it's that close. It barely fits, and it is somewhat covering the line. But I wanted to get this in there. So any hangover, I will trim off. Um, 
and it's not quite centered, but I'm just going to go with it. Oops. So I think what I want to do then is actually take this longer one, which is longer than the first piece I pulled off, and let's border that. Let's see how the picture is. Maybe this way? Are they going the same way? I'm trying to make the florals go the same way. No, it's got to go this way. Okay. So this one is going to go on this side. So let's try and make a match as best as possible. And now the reason they aren't quite 100% matched up, because if you recall, I Frankenplan. And if I recall, this is the tab from the black and or no, sorry, not black and gold, the modern months. And this one is the other side of it is from playful abstract. And the reason I had to do that was because I wanted to use the monthly dashboard, which was in the um, or maybe that was modern months. I have the two I get them confused quite frequently, but I needed this page. And just by chance, the fonts were the same. It, but as you can tell, the bottom of them are slightly different. So there's less space on this one for some reason. But I did not let that deter me. I am going to put this one back in the book if I can. Okay. So let me pull out more. So now that I have the washi at the bottom, I'm going to go back here because... There is this quote <clears throat> that I want to put down. And there was, let me check this. Yeah, I was, I'll show you the other one I was thinking of, but that is going to be for another spread. So I don't know if I want to point it out in this video. But um, that's again another aside. There was one of these little ones. Here we go. Okay. So this one I wanted to get midway down. So I want to measure it from the top one. Let's see. I want to give a little bit of a border here. A little bit of space in between. I want to leave space in case there is something that I want to put in here. I can put it there. And then this one is the one I wanted to get. Now, what I'm looking for, that's the floral. Okay. So I'm going to move over to here. And I am going to grab two of the stickers. I'm going to grab this one and this one. All right. And, oops, so this one, it fits perfectly. So if I do that, so I'm going to put this one down here anyway. Now I have all these stickers. I got to work. Um, <laughs> it's what I do. I wanted to layer these two, but there isn't enough room down here. But what I am going to do is still put the floral box, but I'm going to go ahead and white out this line using my jelly roll because I don't want it to show through the box or on the top or bottom. So I'm just gonna take it all the way down. I kinda wanna have a nice clean look on this one. I really loved how my November 22 came out. So I kinda wanna, again, it's florals, but they're different. And I wanted to, um, I'm gonna take these two out as well so that they dry while I work over here. Um, I wanted to make this kind of similar, not exactly the same, but similar, um, because I loved that spread so much. And this book is just so pretty. I figured, you know, with the holidays coming up, it might be easier, less stressful to decide on, you know, like a one book November. I can't say I'm going to stick to it, but at least to keep my currently page my month and my monthly dashboard similar I would prefer to do that just because I like the cohesive look it gets um, so that's why I'm trying to keep a similar theme 
Now, by the time I get into the weeks, that's probably going to change, but, you know, that's okay. So once this is done, I will go back to the other side. Let me cover my pen. All right, so we're going to let this one dry. I'm going to come back here, and I am going to get in here the floral box as best as I can. In fact, this one I think I need to set down for a minute. Because if I put this one in crooked, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> so I think what I want to do is take it to the edge over here. And before I put it down, see there's always a little thing. I want to white out this little bit of line over here. Remember I said the uh, washi didn't go all the way to the edge? So I kind of want to hide that because this is going to go all the way to the edge. So the edge of this box, and I had just this little bit of line over here that was kind of bugging me. So let me get this dried. Okay, it should be dry enough. I'm gonna go with it. So let's get this one in. And I'm just gonna put it right up against this washi. Hopefully I didn't get that on me. We're gonna grab this one and I'm gonna come back over here. Now, the other thing is with this box being here, as I said, it kind of filters over and I will fix that. I may not put one here. I think I'm just gonna white out that little spot there because um, I just want that extra space available to me to um, you know, be able to write and I don't want it, I don't want to put a sticker over this these flowers. I suppose I could use my Dymo Lake Maker for a like clear one, maybe a clear sticker, and that may be what I do. But I don't want to put a full box over it. So before I put this down, I want to make sure that I don't have, I did not have another plan to put something under it. So let me just quickly scan. Okay, so I'm not seeing a particular box, so I'm just going to go ahead with this one, and I'm going to get it as centered as I can, as best as I can. Let's see. And that's, of course, assuming that the sticker is cut straight. Um, if it isn't, well, then it won't be kind of centered. I think that's pretty good. I'm going to go with it. And then I'm going to grab this box here because it has, again, the little florals, but it has this cute little pumpkin, which I got to have my pumpkins in November. So I am going to see if I can fit this in down here. It's going to filter over onto a Sunday, but that's okay. I don't mind that. If it was a weekday, it'd be a different story. But um, it's not, so we're good. Okay. I just wanted to trim that little bit of, um, like, sticker fluff, I guess you might call it. <laughs> okay. Moving forward. I'm just making a mess of everything here. Off on the side, you can't see it. It's just a mess. So let me get this put back over here so that you can see where I am. And then I want to get, so see, the months are easy enough because I don't typically, like I use it as my plan um, tentative, meaning I usually use post-it notes in here until I know for certain that something's going to go where it's going to go. So what I'm going to do is I am going to find, oops, here's my green that I used in the other spread. And this has, so it has some greens in it. Um, there is this brown, which does not match this, but that's okay. Let's see, roses. I'm looking for um, some options. So... I am going to go through, highlight my, before I get too far, I'm going to highlight my holidays. I'm just going to take a light swash of this color and give it a little highlight. 
I like to see, I'm going to highlight Thanksgiving. I don't know if I'm going to put a sticker in that box or not, um, but I do like to have my holidays highlighted or at least the holidays listed and special dates. Um, now I usually give myself a swash of color in the dates. So November, but I think this time around, I'm just going to do the week day. So I'm going to do this, this. I kind of, well, that really went off the rail. <laughs> I kind of want to like let my, uh, the florals and the browns kind of highlight, be more prominent and then just have this as a highlight. All right, so I did have, whoops, my pen's getting away from me. I'm going to go back to my book because there is, um, I've got this one here, important, oops. I don't want to do today's plans because this is a month spread, so I don't want to put that down. Um, I do have this floral. I'm going to try and take from the page what I can now. And then I can go to the next page. So I'm going to have a handful of stickers <laughs> that I am going to put down. This floral, I don't believe, is that, I'm not sure if this one is or not. There's a rose and I'm not sure, I guess it is. It's this one, I think. We'll get to it. But for now, what I want to do is... Um, I don't want to convolute my corner up here since I already have a box there. So I'm going to change my plan for this and I'm going to put this over here. I'm going to kind of have it go in the same direction. Or maybe not. I think I'll do it in a different direction. And then I am going to put over here for this box here, this little box, um, I'm going to put a swash of color. And that'll be where I can put my um, label for my box. I'm thinking and working, and apparently for today that's not working out. So I do see on this page there are two uh, leaf swatches. So I think I'm going to use both of them on this spread because I want to put, let me make sure I got them the right way here. I want to put one on this side, one here, and then I want to bring the other one. I still haven't gotten rid of this sticker yet. I'm getting to it. <laughs> I'm, I think I'm more running out of space more than anything. There we go. Okay. And then this one, I want to put on this other side here. So it's going to be touching the box slightly. And then let's take care of this one because I don't want to um, forget this. Now... I know that I'll probably have to use a thicker pen to, when I do this, but I'm going to put this over here because I am going to write in this box. So I'll just use a dart, like make sure I use a black pen so that it shows through. So I'm going to put this one up here. I just feel like all this layering is just giving it so much, um, so much goodness. Like, look at that. Okay. Almost done. I say almost because, let me go back. Okay, so I definitely wanna get a pair of boots in here. So in this case, I would wanna use probably the green. So let's use that. See what I mean? I said quick and it's really not happening that quick. I wanna put these over here. I'm gonna put them just on the edge. Let's see, this is what, a Saturday? Let's get them. Let's put them about here. 
Still gives me enough room to write in on Saturday, um, but I could not resist using them. How cute are those boots? Okay, just a little trim on the edge of that. Oh, here we go. Okay, so I am going to grab this pie And then I'm gonna open it back up to here because I'm going to use these boxes. I'm gonna get these boxes in. And then this one I wanna put, of course, on Thanksgiving. I'm trying to fit it all in here, as you know. Um, let me put this one, I'm actually gonna trim the edge a bit because it is round and I want it to, hopefully I'm getting this at the right angle. I want it to lay flush in the corner, but I don't want to make the pie square. Does that make sense? <laughs> I didn't cut it wrong, right? Oh, so close. Okay, so now I'm moving on to my boxes. So if you have followed for a while and you are, I'm going to do, um, what I'm going to use the boxes for is the days that I plan to post a video, um, which is pretty standard at this point. So I'm, I'm going to put them in. I'm not going to use a sticky note. The only thing I'll use a sticky note for is the idea. Um, so if you follow, and if you followed for a while, you know that um, I talked about moving my desk around or taking down a desk really more than anything. And... I haven't done it yet, but I've been, you know, of course, thinking about, gosh, where am I going to put it, right? Um, so I think we're what? We're coming near the end of October now. So I have to come up with a plan because, well, I'm running out of time. And in my family, we've always put up our tree early. Um, at least the craft room tree, the main tree will go up um Usually Thanksgiving weekend, but the, and that's why I put also my craft tree up earlier because then it gives me an opportunity to um, be able to focus in on doing the main tree. So I've been thinking a lot about what am I going to do? <laughs> I mean, I sort of have a plan. It's going to definitely be an adjustment for sure. Um, so I don't know exactly what I'm going to do about that, but... Um, it's in the works. It's sooner or later. And of course, when I go and try and do the video at that point, it probably won't be as light out. So the video won't be as bright, you know, we're into our fall season and, you know, it's kind of just gray skies and rain. Um, I'm going to cover up my nail polish swatchy that I just put on there. I really don't like when my nail polish comes off. I don't know why it does. It just does. Let's see. So there is that. I'm working on that, of course, um, among other things. That's the more bigger project because that's going to require... I move some things around and take some things down. So, oh, you know what? I put the pie on the wrong day. For real? I did that? All right, so let me get this up and hopefully it comes up because I know... The stickers from the currently page did not come up that easily. So I'm hoping that it's not been stuck down too long, that it won't come up nicely. I'm just going to take it slow. I don't want to ruin the paper or the sticker. Yay. Okay, let's try this again. Let's try getting it on Thursday, Thanksgiving, when it's supposed to be. <laughs> Let me get that bent back out now. Okay. So it should be easier now because the, the bottom half is really just on Thanksgiving. So because, oh, I just wiped that off. I'm having like one of those days today. It's Friday. Uh, you'll see this on Saturday, but this is Friday. Let's see if I could cover that a smidge more. Um... I'm not putting a sticker on Thursday. I got to figure out what I'm going to do that week because I don't want to miss posting for you. But I also um, 
won't be posting a course on Thursday. I may, you know, if I can record in advance, do that and then I'll um, post for that day. So that may come. But for now, um, same thing for this day. But for now, I'm just going to put the stickers on the clear, clear days, the ones that are obvious. And I ran out of the gold squares. So I will use, um, let's see, there's two bigger ones on here. So let's see, the yellow would go as well, the gold, golden yellow. Yeah, it looks pretty similar. I'm going to use the yellow. All right, so this one will go in here. Hopefully that went on straight. All right, and then as I said, I have this day and this day I have to account for. So I'm not going to put anything down definite just yet. Uh, let me go back in here because I need gold or bronzy stickers, I guess. And I'm going to pull off this one. If I can get it off. There we go. And, um, and since this is clear... It will go right over here perfectly. There. Yeah, that's cute. Which works perfectly because um, I have in the other labels I wanted to grab, I wanted to put here. I'm going to hold this page because there are some things from there I wanted to grab. I wanted to grab out... Um, Celebrate. I think for this, I want to use that for a week page. Or you know what? This is what I'm going to do. And this. Okay. These stickers are challenging me today. So on this page here, I want to do celebrate down here. In fact, I'm going to trim it out. So let me grab my scissors. It's not perfectly straight, but at least it doesn't have the loops on the bottom of the writing. If that makes sense. Okay. And then I got nail polish there too. It's just the way it is. Okay. And then I'm going to come back to here because also on this page, I want to put these um, little sparkles. This one's going to go down here. And I purposely didn't take this one all the way to the edge because there was this floral that's hanging over. But let me see if I can move it anyway because it does look like it's not correct, if that makes sense. See what I mean by the struggle is real? <laughs> it's like it knows it's Friday. It's challenging me. Okay, I think it'll just look a little bit better if I take it right to the corner. Even though it's going to go over the floral, that is okay. So this one will go here. There. Looks a little better when it's not in, you know, not set up into the corners. That's that balance I talk about. All right, and then I want to make sure 
All right, so I'm gonna grab a, little, a few decorations. I am going to take these boots and I'm gonna pop them in over on this side now. Let's see. I'm gonna put them this way. I am going to grab one of these long copper leaves. And I think I'm gonna close this thing. I could keep going with this all day. I'm gonna close it so that when I finish, I'm finished, hopefully. And let's see, this one is going to go over here. I think I got everything. I just have to do my November tab over here. I'm gonna have to wait this out a bit. I gotta trim this off, but otherwise, I'm thinking it looks really cute. So I'm good with this. So there is my November month in my classic happy planner using the fall harvest book, which I love, 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 love. I need another one. I'm telling you, I'll put it in the description box below. Last time I looked, they were going fast. So be sure to grab yours. Um, as fast as you can because if you love this layout and you love the prior one that I did last November um, you're just gonna love this sticker book so here's my month I'm finished I'm not gonna go anymore with it I'm gonna leave it be and I'm gonna say that it's perfect so I hope I've inspired you to do something creative today and every day and that you create your beautiful life one plan at a time thank you for watching